Hi, um, this is AP Calculus BC 2003, um, question 1. Uh, for question A, uh, we need to find the area of R. And for this question, uh, we need to find uh, what x is when the two equation intercepts. So because this is in a uh, question in the calculator section, we use our calculator. Just uh, put y equals x and y equals either negative 3x into calculator and find an intercept and uh, find this intercept and it should come up to a um, x equals 0 0.238734 and uh, let's set the oh we're gonna set this as the t value or let's set b value b equals 0 0.23473 uh, we, all we have to do is store this number to um, any letter and then set up the integral um, from b to 1 because it, you go from b to 1 And then uh, the second part, um, we have to figure out uh, if this is uh, the first function or the second function. Uh, it's obviously this. This is uh, the square root of x, and this uh, this equation is this. So we need to do the upper function um, minus the bottom function. Again, we plug that into our calculator, and we'll get um, this, so point, and we just cut it off at very significant figures. Uh, the second part of the question asks uh, if this R volume uh, is rotated around Y equals 1, and then we have to find the volume of that. So um, all we have to do, same thing. It's from zero, uh, from b to one, and all we have to do is find the outer, the value of um, the outer function minus the inside function. So uh, the equation of uh, volume is this: from b to one. The outer function is obviously e to the negative three x, but then we want this this portion so we want uh, 1 minus uh, this to get this so 1 minus e to the negative 3x uh, we just want to square that and minus same thing with the other function, uh, equation. 1 minus e to the... Um, at this point, we can uh, do simplification, but then um, it would be better for us to just plug in the calculator and uh, let it do it for us. So that should come out to be... Um, uh, 1 point four two three that's it for part C we need to find um, the volume of a solid um, and for this solid each cross section is per perpendicular to the x-axis as um, a rectangle whose height is five times the length of the base so every, let's say this is x and and um, the rectangle at this point will be x times uh, 5x, which will be uh, 5x squared. So I think uh, we need to come up with a general term for the rectangle. Let's say um, length or base. Um, base 
at base equals um x then um the rectangle um rec will equals uh, five x square because base times height um its height is five h uh five x so x times five x equals uh five x square uh, so all we have to do is plug um this back in. This is the rep representation of the uh the set uh cross section of the uh, region R. So five x So uh, after we come, we've come up with the um, general term. All we do is put it in integral. So volume equals uh, from t to one of five times this thing. Um, x minus uh, e to the negative three. Dx. Now, again, we plug it in the calculator, and uh, we should get one point five five four. That's it.